Oh man, there was one right there. Golly bum. There we go. That was the softest bite I have ever felt. What's going on, jail fishing crew? We're gonna be doing a little private lake fishing. Got me a chatterbait rigged up, a little chartreuse on it. It's a bad mug right there. And then also a little Ike mini flip jig, some Guggen baits. I'm excited to try these out. These are the, the rattling chunks, got a little rattle to them. I'm gonna pair that with the jig. I know it's a flipping jig, but it's a, the thing I saw laying around real close. Even though it is like 70 degrees out here, the water still gonna be cold and we're still gonna have to use some winter tactics to catch some fish. But uh, I'm gonna get these rigged up. Man, that rattle sounds awesome. And honestly, I probably should have trimmed this skirt a little bit, but I have nothing to cut it with. So we're just gonna leave it alone. Probably bite down a little bit just to make it a little bit more compact. Got that special sauce on it, you know, like the jank sauce or whatever they call it. We'll call it yum yum sauce, how about that? <laughs> but uh, yeah, like I was saying, it's dang near 70 degrees today on January 26th. Check that out, golly bum. Yeah, this uh, this is a flipping jig, but I'm mainly just gonna be dragging it and hopping it. Less talk and more action. We'll catch y'all out there. All right, let's get to fishing, y'all. I'm gonna start off with this jig because I ain't caught one on the jig in a long time and really want to get a jig bite. Sometimes fish will want it hot, sometimes they want it dragged, so we'll just have to figure out how they want it. Heck, they might not even eat it at all, I don't know. But that's what the chatterbait's for. That's my real confidence bait right there, the chatterbait. This is all real shallow through here, and it starts about over there where them hay bales are. Out here is where it starts dropping off. Right here is really shallow. I'm gonna pick up that chatterbait and cover some of the shallow water real quick. We had quite a bit of rain the past 24 hours. And it don't matter what degree the water is, it could be 40 degrees. And if, if there's a rain and it brings the water up, them fish are gonna be up. The, the bait's gonna be up and therefore the fish will follow up shallow. I ran it through some carp right there. Did y'all see that? These carp are up shallow. So maybe bass will be too. Dang, there's a dead one right there. one right there. I took the rod out of my hand. I was watching for snakes. There you go. Golly, bum. It's a little one, but he sure was feisty. He felt the hook that time. I was too busy watching for snakes. Throw that jig in there. Bag um it's going around. Well just rip my tail off. You can see it right there in the wire. Oh yeah, ripped her off good. It's my only trailer too. There we go. Finally. That was the softest buy I have ever felt. But by golly, we got one. Don't y'all think that took long enough? Well, in the video, you'll think it happened quick. But man, I fished all this through here. I only had one bite and it was in that other corner back there. But that was the softest spot I ever felt on the chatterbait. I thought I had 
freaking moss on there or something. It's just cold water. Really slow them down a little bit. Gum is another one. There we go. Mm, get in the boat the bank you know man the fish are freezing that fish was shallow like I bounced it off the base of that tree over there and he hit it like three times before I could set the hook make a few more casts with this I'm gonna throw a jig in there Got a little dent in him right there. Look, I'm throwing it like right at the bank. These fish are so shallow. One more cast. Oh, damn. Maybe one more after this one. Then I'll pick that jig up. Baby girl, we fishing, not golly bum. All right, well, that'll work right there, wouldn't it? There you go. Thought we were squirrel hunting for a minute. That was awesome. Ha <laughs> ha. That's just a fun size fish right there. You know, like a fun size candy bar? Them little ones right there are just fun. He wanted that rattling chunk. Tell you what, that was dirt shallow too. All right, let's move on around. There we go, right at the bank. That's why I love this crankbait rod. It's got a little it's a slight delayed tip on it and it allows them to eat it better. See, if I was throwing a regular rod, I'd probably jerk it out of its mouth. But another one. That was just a tad bit better fish right there. Or fifth fish, sixth fish? I don't know. Boom. That's the guard dog Bella. She's a sweet old thing, though. Know? Bella. What you doing? Just me, Bella. I wish one more would bite. One more fish. Come on. They're here somewhere. Last cast. Actually, one more.
All right. Hope y'all have enjoyed the few fish catches that I've got to show you. I know I sure have. I appreciate y'all watching. Don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe.